Well, Kumar Sen, and uh, in this tutorial, you are going to learn about how to solve a numerical problem uh, in case of inventory control, and we have we'll come to know how to find out a reorder point. Okay, so let's get started first. So, the, what is, what is about the question? This question already asked in gate previous year, first and second. In this question, what they have asked that a company uses two thousand five hundred and fifty-five units for an item annually. Okay. And delivery lead time is eight days. So we have to find out ROP. So what is ROP basically? ROP means reorder point. Okay. Most probably in questions you will going to get uh, you will see a reorder point only, not ROP in short. Okay. To uh, in number of units. Okay. To achieve optimum inventory, we have to achieve inventory uh, optimum inventory. Okay. So basically, what happened? You know what we have to find out and what we need to know. So uh, if you have watched my previous videos regarding uh, all types of inventories, uh, I mean, pro, uh, all, just like Wilson Harris model. Okay. So this question is based on that model, Wilson Harris. Okay. I have already, and this is also known as deterministic model. I have already shared with you about it uh, in my previous videos tutorials because I have created a lot of tutorials related to industrial engineering already. So let's go for it. So basically, what we'll get, we know that let's say this is Q, this is T, this is R. We know that R is equal to Q by T. Okay. So what is R basically? R is a consumption rate, or we can say the demand. Okay, Q is order quantity, and T is uh, it's a time period, and uh, we also know uh, known as this as lead time. Okay, now here most important factor to see that is lead time they have given eight days. So we have to convert this into per year. For this, what we have to do? We have to divide this by three sixty five. So it will convert it. Per year, okay. Lead time is eight days, so it will become eight by three sixty-five years because this is given items they have given annually. Okay. Now we got this. So what is basically the reorder point here? That is, this Q is reorder point here. So basically, this is also known as here. This is known as ROP, and uh, as you can see, this is this is known as lead time. Okay. This is all about it. Now, what we have to do? We have to find out Q. So Q is equal to T multiple R. Now, what is T here? Eight, three sixty-five. What is R here? Two five five five. Okay. Now, what we can do? We can either use calculator or we can do it manually. Just do it manually. Uh, five and uh, this is three. Okay. Five thirty. Uh, five seven five thirty-five and one fifteen. Okay, one fifteen five three. Now this is five one one one. So five thousand one hundred. Ah, uh, sorry, it's yeah five double one, right? So this is about it. Now we have to uh, divide this one. So I think we should use calculator now. Five one division thirty seventy three is equal to seven. So eight multiple seven. So it's fifty six. So the reorder point quantity, I mean uh, reorder point quantity, or uh, you can say this is 56 unit. Okay. So answer for this question is 56 unit. I hope you understand the question and how to find out reorder point. I hope you understand about that also. All right. Thanks for watching. Thank you very much. Hope to see you again in my next video tutorial. Bye bye.